End the round. That's a tough way to begin the finals. Meanwhile, the drivers of Tiger Bolt, the Edison Technical High School finalists, are looking to repeat their semifinal sweep and win it all. The crowd is having a ball here in sunny Orlando. The Disney folks, well, they know how to party. As the music ends, we're ready for round two of the finals. Okay, three, two, one, go! There goes Tiger Bolt, moving off to its usual smooth start, picking up those three-point balls. Lakewood! Well, looks like they might try a little bit. Yeah, they're trying some interference tactics here. And they succeed in making Tiger Bolt dump its own five-point ball off the goal. Tiger Bolt suddenly seems vulnerable as it's having trouble finding the right spot to dump its balls, while Lakewood, well, that delivery is near flawless. You gotta wonder, are those talented Tiger drivers finally cracking? Any ball landing outside the field is returned by the referees. Keep in mind, Lakewood's taking advantage of that right now. Too easy, two heads to score its first 10-pointer. If this goes down, it's good. Tiger Bolt, it's almost like it's running on its own. Can't seem to find the right direction. This is very unusual. This is not the same Tiger Bolt team that we have seen clawing its way all the way into the finals. They're disengorging a few of those yellow balls. It looks like we'll be going to a third round as Lakewood picks up its second 10-pointer and heads for the goal yet again. But now Tiger Bolt's back in it, shoving Lakewood aside. It's going for the goal. This is a battle of two powerful machines right now. Who can get it down? Two Easy Two is settling on holding Tiger Bolt out, and Two Easy Two picks up the win. This Lakewood team has fought back from being tied up on the ropes last round to forcing Tiger Bolt into what will be a decisive final round. When we come back, we'll find out who will be crowned the 1996 U.S. First National Champion. The official sponsors of the 1996 U.S. First competition are Honeywell, Procter & Gamble, and Motorola and are being brought to you by Johnson & Johnson. Well, it's all come down to this. Welcome back to the 1996 U.S. First National Championships, where in the true and best spirit of competition, the two teams wish each other luck as they get set for this third and decisive game of the finals. Lakewood High School out of St. Petersburg, Florida. Brian, what are you doing? They look to take on Edison Technical High School from Rochester, New York. Both square off for one last game. The winner will be crowned the 1996 U.S. First okay, National three, Champion. Two, and for the last one, time, go. there goes the horn and we are off. Now remember, both these machines as well as the 72 others that came here to Orlando to compete were built by a high school corporate partnership in just six and a half weeks. Seeing them here now in the finals, it amazes me the precision and reliability of their engineering as well as the skill of the high school student driver. Now both Tiger Bolt and Too Easy 2 have been concentrating on getting their three-point small balls in the goal. But now Too Easy 2 looks to open up those great big arms. Look at that, like claws, like Schwarzenegger. Uh, I got my ball and now I look to put it in the goal. Meantime, Tiger Bolt is still getting its last three pointers from its human player with a great big burst of speed. It heads over to the goal to score its balls. And they are all, well, no, they're not all out. There's still one left. While well, they try to work that out, take a look at Too Easy 2. See ya! Ten points down and in. Oh, a little battling brewing now between these two. A lot of bad blood, I'm sure. This is for the championship, the final match. Tiger Bolt. Whizzing around on the far side, needs 10 points of its own, no problem. Too easy two now, looking for a little defense. Who's gonna pick up that final ball? Now keep in mind, ah, nice job defensively done by Tiger Bull. That's Too Easy Two's ball, but Too Easy Two says, great, I'll grab your ball. Whatever you can do, I can do better. Take that, Tiger Bolt. They gobble up Tiger Bolt's final three-point ball. Now look at that. Too Easy Two was going after its final red ball in the far corner. Tiger Bolt saw that and is now pinning Too Easy Two against the wall. It doesn't appear anybody's going to be able to score here in the final moment. That is the final contest. I think what it's going to come down to is those officials. Those officials are trying to determine the amount of points for each team. Now, unofficially, 
We have them all tied up, which means it could come down to the height of those big balls. And it appears that the advantage would go to Edison Technical School and the yellow ball. Can you believe it? After six and a half weeks, it's all come down to this. Maybe just a few inches is going to separate these two balls and determine the winner. And we have the official results by referee's decision. Well, you heard it, it's official. The celebration is on for Edison Technical School. It did come down to the height of the ball, and Edison Tech, by a nose, picks up the win. They'll be headed to the White House for national recognition. Congratulations to Edison Technical School, our 1996 U.S. First National Champions. Rochester, New York. The hardware goes up high as Edison Technical School out of Rochester, New York, proudly displays their wares. It has been a well-fought battle throughout, and Edison Tech comes away with the national championship. Congratulations. It was just so exciting. We didn't expect to get this far, and it was just great. We just came from behind and had an excellent Well, the Edison Technical School told us before this competition began that their motto was to keep it simple. Just devour as many of those small balls as possible and go after their opponent's large balls. Today, that strategy played out to the tune of a national championship. Congratulations to them. For Ann Craig, I'm Dan Debenham. So long from Epcot Center. We'll see you next time right here for the U.S. First National Championships.